ClickUp Brain is ClickUp's AI feature. All products offer an AI feature, but we know just because a platform jumps on the AI bandwagon doesn't actually mean it improves their product. So in this video, we're looking at ClickUp's AI Brain, when to use it, and see if it actually improves your workflows. Hi there, I'm Alex Knowles from automationhelpers.com, and we help companies like yours get automated through portals, apps, and integrations. AI has quickly become a normal part of our working life. The pace of progress is staggering and it's only looking to continue and improve. Now, many platforms rush releasing an AI feature that doesn't really offer any meaningful value. ClickUp positions itself as an all-in-one solution. But how does its AI feature actually help you and your work? Now, getting started with ClickUp Brain is simple. You'll find the AI chatbot here in the bottom right corner. Then you can select from some templatized prompts. Let's see what my current tasks are. Nice. Now, of course you can custom prompt ClickUp Brain and get a more in-depth response. So let's do that. Let's ask about a specific day. And there we go. In seconds, it produces us with more info and we don't have to dive deep into our workspace to find that info. Now you can also access ClickUp Brain directly in ClickUp Chat and in ClickUp Docs, but First, let's look at how you can use ClickUp Brain directly in your workflows. You can quickly use the suggested prompts we see here, which is definitely helpful when you're just first jumping onto ClickUp for the day and about to begin your work. Those of us who work in a team and need to post a daily stand-up to keep everyone updated can lean on ClickUp Brain as a writing assistant to do the task for them, keeping your team up to date with what you are working on. Super easy. If you are wondering where a project handled by a colleague is at, or are just curious to know what your team is working on, you can quickly prompt ClickUp Brain as well and get a response in seconds that updates you with no need to dive deeper into your workspace and find the info. You can search for anything in the final suggested prompt. Perhaps you want to quickly understand what your tasks are for the week, or maybe you're looking for a certain doc to help you begin your work. Well, you can rely on ClickUp Brain to quickly find what you are searching for. ClickUp Brain is a great way to get quick info on the tasks at hand, but we always need to consider security. Well, here on ClickUp's landing page, we can see the current security measures in place. ClickUp Brain is actually GDPR and SOC 2 compliant, and will be HIPAA compliant soon. So keep your eyes peeled for that release. Now, like most work management systems or tools, the AI feature is an add-on. I was sure that I'd saw the price as $5 USD a month. It might still be that, and this might actually be revealing AUD, which is Aussie dollary dues. So let's look at how you can use ClickUp Brain and understand whether the add-on is actually worth it, worth that price. So jumping into the ClickUp workspace here, let's firstly look at its summarizing capabilities. If you've got a long document to read before a meeting and don't have time, you can lean on ClickUp's AI to quickly summarize important points and get you ready. There we go. We can just quickly jump into the meeting, all ready to go. However, you cannot currently upload the document and instead, hopefully you're housing all your docs and your wikis directly in your ClickUp workspace. This next feature is super cool. With ClickUp AI, you can connect and search your other apps. Just select the ClickUp Brain chatbot in the bottom right again and select apps. Then you'll see a list of the available apps. You can search Google Drives, Figma files, GitHub pull requests, and more directly within your ClickUp workspace. This is great for all teams. You can directly reference a design file in Figma that the team needs to give the all clear or search and import your lead data from a Google Sheet. There are a lot of great use cases here. Now, we also find that larger teams for those in product and development are more likely to use Jira as their task and project management, while the marketing, customer support and sales team are more likely to use a platform like ClickUp or Airtable or Monday.com. Well. Here in ClickUp, we can connect directly to Jira and search for bug releases, product updates, feature releases, and more without needing to annoy our team's devs. So that's a cool feature to note. Some really cool use cases are being revealed already, but how well does ClickUp Brain help you write? Now, if you need to draft an SOP, a meeting agenda, or a product description, ClickUp AI can help give you a head start by providing structure, formatting, and ideas. So for example, here in a doc, we'll ask ClickUp AI to 
generate a meeting agenda based on our project market research task. Now, I haven't included a lot of info for that research market task, so we'll see what it actually pulls through. And that's actually pretty handy and useful. This cuts down so much time and allows you to focus on the meeting itself or other tasks that are due today. We can also lean on AI here to draft SOPs for us. Now, yes, you will need to make changes to it, but you're provided with the overall structure and get a head start in seconds, which is helpful. We can also use ClickUp AI directly in chat if we just navigate over here. Now, if you're part of a team that posts a daily stand-up, you can now directly reference the tasks you have due today in the future and generate a stand-up without having to think. This not only saves time, but gets you ready for the day. You're able to see what tasks you've got to knock off today. Now, you can also, of course, summarize your team's conversation if you took a vacation last week and you want to catch up on anything you missed, which is another super powerful feature. I definitely see some value in ClickUp Brain. I guess it depends how large your team is and how much you utilize the other ClickUp features, specifically the docs feature and chat. Here we have my ClickUp Home dashboard, which is nothing exciting, right? Just my tasks. Now what ClickUp does a great job of is visualizing your work and your team's work through dashboards. In a dashboard, you have cards, which could be referred to as widgets or perhaps views in other platforms. Now, basically, you can use your workspace's data for team reporting, time tracking, and more using cards. You'll pull your data into a card and then manipulate it, format, and visualize it. So we can see here on a custom dashboard, our card options are pretty diverse. However, if we jump back to the home dashboard, it's limited to what cards you can include. But what we can include is an AI stand-up. We can configure what days we want to summarize, how it is formatted, and generate a stand-up for us when we first log on. This way, you can view a quick summary of your task for the day and get ready and a head start. Now, surprisingly, it doesn't appear as though you can use AI in your custom dashboards, which is a bummer. I would love to see this, especially if I navigated to my growth space. I would love to be able to include a card that uses AI to quickly summarize my team's progress so I can get a quick summary. Now, while ClickUp states that ClickUp Brain generates tasks, I'm not so convinced. Let's check it out. When I directly ask ClickUp Brain, it fails. However, it can help us create tasks. Let's head back to growth and create a new task. Then here we can lean on AI. We'll try by asking it to create subtasks for a basic product launch task. Now, if AI gets this right, this could be super helpful if you quickly want to break your complex tasks into more digestible chunks. However, what is the quality of the subtask going to be? Well, let's see, a product launch task, simple market research, analyze competitors, identify target audience, product development. Now we can directly insert, edit, copy or retry. We'll just insert and it hasn't actually created the task. Well, not at least the name. And it's only included that info as a description it looks like. So it cannot directly generate subtasks from the task creation. But up here, we can notice some suggested prompts from ClickUp Brain, one of which is generate subtasks. So we'll click that and not bad. Finalize product features, develop marketing materials, train sales team, that's pretty good. So it created five subtasks that could definitely help teams in quickly turning those complex tasks into more actionable items. So here we can also directly ask AI for more info on a task, which again pulls in some great reference prompts. Um, let's just try creating another task, but this time without that description info, I'll create an email campaign task, then ask it to generate those subtasks quickly and I definitely think there's some value in that feature. Again, you are going to have to change the structure, the formatting and make it really yours, but it's a head start. Now we're going to look at how ClickUp Brain can help you in setting up automations in your ClickUp workspace. In ClickUp, you can create automations that do tedious tasks for you on autopilot. I know that product tasks should be assigned directly to me automatically, so I could manually create an automation that when a new task is created in product, assign it to me, or 
I can have ClickUp Brain create the automation for me. Now, much like Zapier's Copilot, if you are familiar with it, we can just simply prompt ClickUp Brain so that when a new task is created in product space, assign it to Alex Knowles. And ClickUp AI begins building out the automation and it did it quickly. Now, I, I should also mention that you can directly search your workspace up here and your connected apps. Remember, Google, Jira, GitHub, Figma, from the top navigation bar up here, quick and easy. And while you can call upon AI from the new task and doc option that you select up here, for some reason, you cannot access AI in the chat option through here. Instead, you must go directly to the chat window and then prompt it there. The last notable functionality of ClickUp Brain is through ClickUp templates. Just select new in the top navigation again, and you'll notice the template button here. If your button is acting buggy, make sure you've selected a space here and that should resolve the issue. Now we can use templates created by ClickUp, generate tasks, stocks, list space, and more. And you're also able to create your own templates, but I want to show you how AI is integrated into this templates feature. So I'm just gonna select the chatbot and then type template. Then you'll be able to select generate a template, provide some details. I'll just call it bug report and generate. And then we can see ClickUp Brain is creating a structure bug report with description, what do we have? Details, checklist, and more. You can then create a template from this and then reference it whenever creating a new bug report task or doc or however you handle your bug reports. Now, personally, I couldn't see myself using this in my workflow as I can just easily prompt AI whenever creating a new task or just simply create a template directly in a task. So, I wouldn't really need this extra feature. So we've looked at how to access ClickUp Brain and when to access ClickUp Brain, but is it really worth it? Well, I think there are definitely features that are unnecessary, but I will be honest, I do see value. I do love the ability that you can access AI directly in your work management system. I find myself leaning on ChatGPT regularly and not having to jump between tabs whenever I want to prompt ChatGPT to do something for me is great. Now, I know that ClickUp's language model is based on ChatGPT, so that is thumbs up from me. Also, the ability to quickly reference and search not only my ClickUp workspace, but also my other apps like Google Drive, Jira, Figma, and more makes this a super powerful feature. Plus, if you are using ClickUp Chat, Communicating quickly with your team and recapping any missed conversations is another winning point. I imagine we will see further improvements from ClickUp Brain and I'm excited to see the next release. Now, if you need help automating parts of your business or setting up a work management system, don't hesitate to reach out to our team at automationhelpers.com. We offer a free 30 minute consultation, so book yours today.